In this next video, I'm going to answer some questions regarding delegating an inbox and what you should expect to see. So to start, when you're looking for an inbox that's been delegated to you, you have to be in the mail app. So if we come up here to the upper right hand corner to our Google Apps icon, we have the Gmail app here. So you have to be here and I'll show you why. So right now I'm in Team Drive, which you can see over here. And if I come up here to the little letter T and I click on it, yours will, yours will be based on your name. I'm not going to see a delegated account. So it will be an account with delegated after it. So I don't see it there. So then I'm like, what? I accepted it. Why don't I see it? It's because I'm not in mail. So you, even though it looks the same in the upper right hand corner with the T, you have to be in Gmail to see your delegated account. So I go ahead and I click Gmail. So here I am in my inbox for my FireNet account and I click on it and I'm gonna scroll down. So now I can see the delegated account. So my second question that we get is, you've, uh, you're in the right place, you're here, you're looking, but the delegated account is not there. So at that point, the issue might be that the account was just delegated to you and it takes it can take like 30 minutes. So be patient once the account is delegated and you can find the directions in that video. Once the account's been delegated and accepted, it can take 30-ish minutes sometimes for that delegation to go into effect. So make sure to give that uh, time and you will see the delegated account in your dropdown again as long as you are in Gmail and you come up to your colored letter up here on the right and you'll see it in your list. Thanks so much.